windy up here today, guys. Uh, us pike pond, me and Barry go fishing it sometimes. But the other one's a reservoir there. We go fishing there as well, but we don't go fishing at this side of it, we go fishing the other side of it. I think I put photos of the other side in before, eh? Uh, sheep, eh? Sheep poo. Some big pike in that. That wee loch joins into that big loch here, eh? I'm trying to zoom in a bit. There's a joining in there over there. Uh, it's quite nice. This is up the back of Loch Ness, eh? It's right up the back, but... Tina sat over there in the car. Uh, there's a farm on the hill over there, look. You see the farm? It's quite a big farm. They used to have a lot of cows, eh? Cows used to be in this field here, eh? Uh, that's a reservoir over there for the Merness. Pylons. Uh, a wee bit of wooded area. Uh, quite nice, like I say. Got a nice area, like, like I say. We go fishing down there sometimes, eh? We we'll get a big pike out of there. Oh look, there's some sheared black-faced sheep. And there's Tina. And there's lost the wheel trim off my car, so never mind, eh? Right, look. Fishing by permit only. Uh, you don't need a permit. You don't need a permit to fish for a uh, brown trout in Scotland. So that's technically why. But it's just to deter too many people from fishing here. Uh, some stickers on the back of the car. Uh, there's a farmer that passed us. Or maybe I want to turn. Oh, oh, turn. Uh, I this is us heading now back down into the village of Door. Um, the car on going down this way. Well, up this way and then down. See we meet any low flying natters. Usually meet up quite a few low flying natters like one of them is me. Whoa, <laughs> bit bouncy, eh? Show 
Oh yeah, be the wall. That's look nice. Looking all the way down, you can see a boat going out. I can bear with me shooting you about. We'll go out and all you look. Inverness is back that way. About 12 miles from here. That wee bit in there, that's Port Augustus. Port Augustus, sorry, drum of the rocket. Port Augustus further down that way. Down there. There's a clans one on the other side. And the road you can see on the other side as well. It's a breaking up on the top. I've actually been right up on the top of that, the land door. It's quite a nice area. That's it, it's quite a nice area. I notice there's loads of deer coming up and killed here. Mmm, the doll. Farm land. Nah. It's all farm ground. Mm, we got to see a drum with rockets in that wee. We drove down there. And there's Tina in the car. Look. There's Tina in the car waving. Sorry, the air come up to the compressor and this thing's making a heck of a rocket. And the wipers aren't a much better. There's not really that much rain to be fair, eh? There's not really a lot of rain, eh? Mm. Back towards Inverness. Inverness is about, like I said, 12 miles that way. We'll go down this hill with the car anyway. And Doors Beach is just down there. It juts out quite a bit, you see. The ground juts out quite a bit. We're going to set off again towards back towards Inverness. You can speak, you know, Tina, you're allowed. Yes, I am. I don't like single track Tina doesn't like a single track, but this is double here. It goes double to single, single to double. Always does. You should know that by now. Yes, I know. Good brakes in this thing, it'll hold you back. Cows coming up. No cows coming up, babe. There's cows in the fields. They're sitting down. They say that the cows sitting down over here is a sign of the rain. Eh? I'm not so sure on that. It's raining. It's raining at the moment, like. But. I like uh, I like the rain. Not not the part that's noisy. Good day, Pushy. Sure, Snobby would agree with me there. I 
I use a flamethrower. It's lighting up up the front. Strapped up mine. It's not that great in this one. I did do one for it, but I just haven't got around to doing it. Quite a nice area, I love this place. Uh, peaceful. The internet signal was rubbish, so. Uh, oh. <laughs> An old Fordson Dexter, by the looks of it. Wonder if the guy would let me start it up, eh? <laughs> Probably not. I think that's a sawmill in there, I'm not 100% sure there. I don't know this place that well. Uh. I'm more from the other side, you think? And this is just coming down into the doors. The doors are a nice new village. Usually a lot of tourists indoors, like. A lot of tourists here, like. Big tourist place. Double or single. 
Uh, so I'm just sitting 50 mile an hour. I don't really go much faster than that anyway. Like, I I'll do I'll do 60 on it if I have to, but I don't have to. I'm not in any hurry. I'm not in any hurry. I've all day. I've all day and tomorrow that I haven't touched. That was one of my father's favourite sayings. Don't do today what you can put off till tomorrow. Don't put off today what you don't have to do tomorrow. Do what you have to do today and never do Ah oh, no. Tomorrow never comes. Again, all wrong. Don't do today what you can put off till tomorrow. Like I say. No, that was backwards. Yeah, exactly. Ah. Do today what you don't have to do tomorrow. No. Tomorrow never comes. Next one. 